Good day friends, my name is Ruth and welcome back to my channel, welcome back to another episode of Modded Skyrim, if you're new here consider liking and subscribing. So we're right outside of Hilgrun's tomb, which we um, completed last time, I want to take this potion, because I just saw it. Uh, do I have my light on? No. So today I want to go to Ingle's Barrow, I do not know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> and first I think I should go to... Wait, was it Winterhold? I know that the tomb is somewhere over here. First, I think I should go to Winterhold. Okay, I think I'm supposed to speak to the innkeeper. Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks. Or maybe not. I don't remember, to be honest. I know the name of the person, not you. What the hell is a naked Rigmore doing with me? I updated the mod. A Rigmore of Cyrodiil, and I'm assuming um, I broke it somehow. Ah, man, both of you. You are not the one. I understand Iris been planning to hunt the elf. Maybe she owns a store. I. Why do I not remember? Oh my god. If anybody knows why the hell Rigmore is following me around, please tell me. Cause I don't know. I installed it correctly. I definitely reinst reinstalled the mod correctly. I updated it, and I don't know what the hell is happening. Is it true what they say? There was a dragon held captive in Whiterun, and you you released it by the gods, woman. Why? I don't even know what to say. Does she sell it or should I ask her about it? I don't remember. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Yeah, no, she does not sell it. Do you get much business way up here? Very funny. I'm sure you've noticed that Winterhold isn't exactly overflowing with people. So I'll sell whatever I can. If it's worth putting a price on, you can bet I'll do it. I've been burned a few times, made a few bad deals. But mostly, I come out on top. Why set up shop here? Wasn't by choice, I can tell you that. Options were in short supply. Branmir and I grew up here, and nearly any money I make, he drinks away. Without the coin to pack up and leave, I decided to take to trading. Oh, sounds like you should have left him. You said something about a bad deal? Yeah, it was stupid of me. I shouldn't have believed the story and just refused to trade. But I didn't, and now I'm stuck with this worthless junk. What was the story? Some line about this claw thing in Ingol Barrow. He said it was worth more than its weight in gold if I took it back there. Something about placing it back in Ingol's chamber, I don't know. What was I thinking? Even if it were true, I'm not setting foot in some ancient tomb filled with who knows what. I could look into it for you. I don't even care anymore. You want to check it out? Fine. I'll sell you the thing for 50 gold and then it's your problem. I'll take that claw for 50 gold. Fine, here you go. That's actually you really get cheap. You on account of this thing? It's not my fault. Got it? Yeah, I hear you. But I suppose if it does actually turn out to be worth something, let me know, will you? Nah, no, but I'm not gonna share with All you. Right, then. Yeah, I don't know what the hell is happening. Did that add a side quest? It did not. I still have to deliver the sword to Harold. I believe it's somewhere over here, so I'll go to the farm. I definitely installed the mod correctly and I installed all of the patches and whatever that it needs. So I don't know why this is happening. I do wonder if I still have the quest for Rigmore of Cyrodiil in my um, journal. Mm, not me breaking the game towards the end. <laughs> oh my god. First, let me quickly check. I still have it. Go to the Bannered Mare. So it's working. Yet I have Rigmore following me right now. Without any dialogue or whatever, she's just not reacting. So I don't know what kind of glitch that is. Hmm. <laughs> the ghost of Rigmore has come to haunt me. First, let's complete Ingle Barrow. Let's ignore her for now. 
Until I find out uh, how to fix that, I guess. If I can fix that. I believe this is the barrel. Yes. I will remove that. And I believe something is chasing us. Single on the Sea of Ghosts. Salt file. I don't know where Sarana is. Yeah, and we're inside. What kind of... Um, is it? I guess it's stuck to me. Been a while since I done this, so I do not remember <laughs> what happens in this um, barrel. Another orb. This way, maybe? I guess. I don't even know if I should ready my weapon. Uh, it seems that we have some kind of puzzle. Dead scholar. Notes on Ingle Barrow. Let's read them, shall we? Uh, notes. What a peculiar place the barrow turned out to be. I hadn't explored for very long before reaching this elaborate room and gate locking me from going further into the crypt. I confess it, I'm relieved. This place puts the fear of oblivion into me. There are some carvings in this room, I'll attempt to transcribe them for the college so I have something to show for this effort. All was so in that more a land of truth in our home. Man in his throne, so should he be. Whale in the sea, so should he be. Eagle in the sun sky, so should he be. Snake in the weed, so should he be. Sorrow for the sea ghosts to Kingle, prize brother of sail from Atmora's fleet. And none on land, nor sky, nor sea would ever again be as should be. Fascinating, these ancient Nords. I wonder what other secrets are hidden here. Surely there can't be harm in trying to go a little further. And there is a lever here which must open the gate beyond. <laughs> well, yeah, you did not complete the puzzle, my good man. But I don't even know what to do as well. Oh, Serana. So this is the man that sits on the tr throne thing, right? I see a snake. Away the se second water. This probably symbolizes the sun. Let me try that again. I believe this should be the whale, maybe? And the eagle? I was wrong. I was wrong. I mean, there's no markings. How the hell am I supposed to... Or is this the grass? Those are not stopping. Well, I guess I opened it yet. Oh, they're still shooting stuff. I guess we're going deeper in. And I kind of want to go back to the lighthouse from the last episode today. Because I did not know you could put Habit's Remains up there. And also get a boost. Or whatever, which is nice. I missed a lot of things in the last episode, basically. Um, this leads nowhere. Probably should turn my light on, because it's really dark. And apparently it's even darker in video. What do we have here? A chest with a lot of expensive stuff. A sword. An elven great sword. Oh god! Well, that was painful. Sarana just had to push me further in. Oh god. Okay, this is where I'm supposed to use the Coral Claw, right? 
It's the coral claw. Yes. We have what I think is a snake, a wolf, and a dragonfly. Well, did it work? It did. What's over here? A button. Which I'm kind of afraid to push. I do hear jogger sounds. Uh, let me... I don't even know if I have favorited my... New helmet, though. Interesting. There we go. Hello, Ingo's Shade. Okay. He's dead. Helma Vingo. Let's check the chest as well. Song of Hormir, which probably read a while ago. Okay, we have Frozen Flame. Nice. I don't believe anything else useful is here, right? No. We can go higher up. No. No, we can't. Okay, let me check my uh, quest tracker thing. Dungeons. It should have been completed, right? Because I believe it was in the dungeons thing. Yes. Let's see. Coming of age. Let's do that, I guess. Quest in progress. Oh, we still have Frostflow Lighthouse uh, active, active, I guess. Trevor's watch and Volsky. Yeah. Mark complete manually. Oh, so we did it, so I can mark it. Anyway, first let's do coming of age. I think we can leave the Frostflow Lighthouse. The thing that I forgot to do for the end of the episode, maybe. Okay, we still have Naked Rigmore with us. Uh, which way am I going? Yes, over there. I marked it very, very far away from where it's supposed to be. So yeah, I went to the lighthouse. What is that guy? I went to the lighthouse. Um, could not find Hep's remains, interestingly enough. I don't know why. Like everything was gone from that place. But anyway, yeah, now we're, we're supposed to be. Do you hear a dragon? I don't want to deal with a dragon. And I'm suppo supposed to speak with these two, I'm assuming, right? Strength. Who knows what's inside? Treasure, that's what. Get off your scaly rump and let's go. She's hovering. Get away from me. She's hovering. Hello? I admit there is strength in numbers. Perhaps between us. Speak with Miss Salma if you wish to speak. Uh, okay. I'm trying. Uh, we should be inside loading up on treasure. Worry Scales here thinks we should wait, though. Don't get any ideas either. We were here first. Um. What do you expect to find inside? Gold? Silver? Gems, maybe? Only one way to find out. What's going on? I don't care what Beam says. It's high time we get in there and find our fortune. I don't know about you, but I'm going in there. Not without us, you aren't. I'm sure there's enough for everyone, after all. Come on, Beam Jaff. We're going. Okay, guess we're all going. You can't shake us off that easily. <laughs> she just went in there. The dialogue cut off. Okay. Let's see what's inside here. Done. Hello. God. 
My game did not react when I pressed the attack, but that's probably Serana summon spider or whatever. This place is invest infested, not invested, with spiders. Oh god! This is it. We found Gathric's tomb. Have we? You shouldn't run there, like, you know, so bravely. There must be a way Look around. Well, first let me check the chest. Armor. Oh, this thing probably. Whoa, I just flew out of there. First, there's going to be death lords, and he's running away. Oh, that was a trap! Well, you were hiding here. Come on, you're a death lord. Jeez. Oh, now you're brave when you found your friend, huh? I know I'm Lilfin. Well, he's not Lil. <laughs> but he's annoying. <laughs> I've been finding a lot, a lot of gems. Oh, you're, you two are waiting for me, actually. I thought they would just run forward, you know, alone. Without my ass. Is that all of them? She got a weapon from somewhere. I don't... Hell, I didn't expect that when I updated the mod that Rukmore would appear, you know? I... I just didn't. What's this? A helmet? Should I take it? Ah... I see. This is it. Gathric awaits us. Well, we should be careful. Let's just get the treasure here and go! Because I feel... Oh, there's a lot of people. Uh, I feel like he might kill y'all very easily. We are a stronger skeleton, huh? All right, let's do this. Ah, he's Warlord Gather. Let's go kill him. There's a word wall. You know what? I'll get the word wall. They're fighting. Spirit become ethereal. Oh. He seems bigger. Oh, he's definitely bigger than the other Death Lords, for instance. What does he have? Two black soul gems and an ebony war axe built to reanimate corpse. Fool. I should thank you. I knew the girl wouldn't be strong enough to help me kill Gathric alone. There's just one more thing I need from you. To fully absorb Gathric's power, I require blood sacrifice your blood should be good enough this will go easier for us both if you don't bother fighting back show yourself good is dead. damn you i almost died Ooh. teach you well i mean he betrayed you kind of so father never trusted beam I always thought he was just being overprotective. Well, he was right. Don't you want your treasure? Riches and all that? Look, I never needed treasure. My father owns land. Our family is wealthy. I just wanted adventure. Not this. Go on without me. I think I need to be alone for a while. Really? Could have finished it with me. Letter to Bimja. I'll just steal everything from him. 
Because, like, why not? Let's see. Beamja, keep my daughter safe and you'll earn both your freedom and that damn book you want so badly. But by the divines, if any harm comes to her, I'll make sure everyone I do business with will hear about what she did in Black Marsh. Oh. I cannot. The hell is happening with my game? Well, all that left is to check this chest, I guess, because. I can't even go anywhere else. Besides, out, out, you know. Did it complete? I did, my, did not mean to check the companions quest line. Yeah, we're going to go to Lyra's retreat, I guess, probably. I don't even know. It, it doesn't mark in the journal, so I don't even know if I should do it. What's that? Oh, it opened the thing. way all right yes This is big. Okay, let me check. Some other places we can do today for a little bit of experience, because in the next episode I will definitely be starting Grigmore's quest line. And um although I still should check, probably I don't know what the hell is wrong with her since she's <laughs> right here behind me, I guess. And well, I did not start the quest, did I? You know what, let's do this. But is it... It's in Skyrim, right? Well, I already found South Fringe Sanctum, so I guess I could go there. Don't know when I did that. I d <laughs> when I said before that, is it in Skyrim? I don't know why I thought it was in Soul's time. Don't ask me why. I'm weird. And we're here! Let's head inside then. Well, we're inside. Let's see what we shall find in here. Wait, I did something in here, didn't I? Or did I not do something here? Like, I feel like I've been here. I don't know. A spider. Yeah, disgusting thing. Oh, another one. I'm assuming I'm going the correct way. I don't even know how to find the quest that is in here. <laughs> Down. Wait a second, let me kill off the spider first. <laughs> and then I will. Yeah. Quite honestly, I would have not found her probably like yep. Miss, are you okay? Please cut me down. Don't attack me like the other guy did at the beginning of the game. Thanks for getting me out of that. Bashnag's coven chased me out and left me for dead down here. Nobody lasts too long with the spiders. Please, will you help me get out of here? 
If the coast is clear, I'll make a break for it. Uh, can you make it out of here? Bashnag cursed me. I can't cast a spell to save my life right now. I'll have to wait until the way out is safe. I think I killed everything, mostly. The way is out. The way out is clear. Good luck. Thank you. When I find my daughter, it will be thanks to you. I see. Hopefully she won't die. Hopefully. Wait a second. Should I follow her? I should probably just in case. I mean, you do have a dagger, miss. So, like... You can defend yourself with it. Like... <laughs> I don't know. Probably couldn't. Against a huge spider, maybe. Come on, run faster. Okay, we completed it. That was quick, actually. I thought it would be a bit of a longer quest, but it's not. So that's all. Okay, we did it. What else can I do to make this episode a bit more interesting? <laughs> I don't have anything left, to be honest. That's worth doing. Only those random delivery quests. Liar's Retreat. Mist Watch. Maybe Mist Watch? Okay, believe it is here. So let's go to Elder Gleam Sanctuary. Why not? I do hear a dragon. Which I don't like. And there's also a standing stone nearby. Which I could check out, I guess. A wolf. Kinda wish I was on my horse right now. Which I could be. Too lazy to, to hop onto it. Ah oh, yes, and the fort is over there as well, so... Let me just sprint over there. Oh, the Echenex stone. Looks very pretty, to be honest. No, don't see me, dragon. I don't want to deal with you. Just want to go to the fort. Do whatever I'm supposed to do there. And be on my merry way somewhere else. I know I'm the dragonborn. But like, I don't feel like dealing with a dragon right now. <laughs> or ever. I don't know. They just become annoying at a certain point. I will kill all of you, if you attack me. And judging by the way she drew her weapon, I'm assuming she will attack me, yes. Oh, I missed it. Oh my god. Oh. Yes, I call myself a Nord. Watch me kill you. I still don't. Why is Rigmore here? Like, why? Why? I have nothing else to ask, just why? Um, which way should I go, though? There is a little bridge. Then I. Oh, I have to go that way. Of course. I don't know, I don't feel. Quite right today. <laughs> I guess since I I don't know. I'm very off. Okay, let's enter the keep. Or the tower, I should say. Hey, who's there? A friend probably? Stendar's mercy, you aren't one of them. Please, you've got to help me. What's going on? It's my wife, Viola. 
I think she's being held in this tower in my dimension. Calm down, just tell me what happened. I'm sorry. I just you're right. Let me explain. Fiona, my wife, left the farm on errands and never came back. It's been months, and I've been searching for her since. I heard a rumor that these bandits were ransoming captives, so I thought she may be here. I managed to sneak past the guards and get this far, but I don't think I can go on. I'm no warrior. Please, can you look for her? Very well, I'll look for her. Thank you. I don't have much, but I could give you some coin for the trouble. One of the guards dropped this key while I hid. I wager it'll come in handy for you. Please hurry. Do you not even have a weapon? He just came here to look for his wife. Unarmed. Basically. Oh, I'm not hiding from any of you. I don't even know where they are, to be honest. Oh! You are a weak bandit. Up we go then. Hopefully she didn't try to turn herself into a hag raven. See a potion. Maybe she's behind this. In this prison cell, I don't know what to call it. Well, no, I don't see no dead body or anything. Um. Over there? Is there some kind of door? Maybe it was supposed to go down somehow? But no, I don't think so, right? No, because there's no other way. I guess I'll try heading out uh, through that ladder, because I'm assuming it leads out to Skyrim, so maybe she's on the top of the tower? I don't know, to be honest. I have no idea. Oh, the lower balcony. Oh, it's not just... And of course it's raining. Um, over here? Maybe... Oh god. Wait. Of course there's enemies. There you are. Die. Not someone to be trifled okay. with. Really? You came here with a bow? I mean, I didn't deal much damage to her. I literally hit her once. And she just ran... What was that expensive? Oh. A quaif. Oh my god, it's been so long since I heard Rigmore's dialogue when she fights people. But it's too freaking weird that she's still here. Somehow, I will definitely have to show because, like, my thing is, I want to start her quest line in the next episode, right? But if she follows me around, like, I don't know, just you know what I mean. First of all, it shouldn't be like that, second, it's weird, you know, having two Rigmars that would kill me probably. And to be honest. <laughs> well, we're inside. Miner's clothes. We need that. Oh! Snowback. Who are you and what are you doing in my tower? 
Stand aside, woman. I'm here for Fiola. Fiola? How do you know that name? Well, then tell me you're her. Her husband sent me. Where is she? Christer? He's here? Wait, you know him? The fool's my husband. I'm Fiola. Or I was, once. Don't you see? How oh, the hell? I left that old scab. Came home to Skyrim and found this rabble of bandits. Didn't take much to prove myself and knock them into shape. Now every free blade from here to Windhelm wants to sign on for a peace. That's quite a story. And it won't end here. I'd die before I went back. I mean, I won't kill her if she doesn't want to go with her decision. What am I supposed to tell Krister? I don't know. I never expected the old bag to follow me so far. Just get rid of him. But don't kill him. I don't hate the man. I just want him to go back to his farm and forget about me. Okay. I'll try getting him to leave. Take my wedding band. Stoon only knows why I kept it this long. He'll recognize it. Tell him whatever you think will convince him to leave. The ring itself is worth a few bits. Keep it as thanks for cutting off the last vestige of an unwanted fate. Fiola's wedding band. Okay. Well, although I killed at least 90% of her bandits, so I don't know how she's going to deal with that, but since people want to join her still, I guess they can do that. I guess we're going back to Krister then. Okay, now I need to go th I have to go through a lot of doors and trap doors to get to him. This place is interesting. Like he was somewhere over here, I believe, yes. What news? Why isn't Fiola with you? Um, well, you see. Uh, oh, do I really have to give the ring to him? I don't want to. She's dead, but I found this. That. I gave it to her on our wedding day. Help me, Divines. It's true, isn't it? I'm sorry. Keep the ring. I cannot bear the weight of them in my heart. And I must make the journey alone now. Thank you for... Thank you. I kind of feel bad. Viola. Report back. Wait, it's showing me to go... Here. Oh, did she come? Well, at least I don't have to go back to her. Let me sprint before she runs away or something. Hey. Oh, it's you. I didn't think you could handle this on your own. Did you get rid of Christer? Of course I did. He won't bother you again. How did... No, forget it. I don't care to know. I'm free of the little man and that's what matters. I owe you a debt and I aim to repay it. We'll see each other again someday. For now, goodbye and thanks. I don't know what that means. I don't. Can I use her as a follower maybe? I don't know, to be honest. Anyway, let's get the hell out of here. Okay, I guess I will end this episode right here then everybody. It is raining a lot. So I do want to finish it now, this episode I mean, because I want to check out what the hell happened with Rigmore, I will move my camera so that her naked body wouldn't take half of the screen, I'm joking. <laughs> but yeah, I want to check out what the hell happened, because she shouldn't be here. So in the next episode we will start her quest line, I think, because I really want to do it. I feel like I'm prepared. I will do some stuff off camera, like, you know, potions and whatever. And clearing my inventory out. Uh, so yeah, I do hope you enjoyed this episode. Um, if you did, please like and subscribe. It was a roller coaster. I don't even know what the hell happened. Like, it's very messy. <laughs> um, yeah. Anyway, I still hope you liked it. Please like and subscribe again. And follow me on my social media somewhere on the screen or in the description. I would appreciate it a lot. And I shall see you all in the next episode on Friday. 
I hope you have a very great day and the rest of the week. Um, goodbye.